Hello and welcome to Invasion Mode of Orosi Valley in Castle Story. I am Twisted Logic, and welcome to the channel. Excellent. So I think in order to do this one, I need a new task for uh, tree collection. I gotta get rid of these trees right here to start out with. These ones right here. Okay, set that. And I'll build a... Um, Chopping blocks, two of them. There and there. Some stockpiles in this area over here. Excellent. I was playing this last night, not this map, but um, the game crashed out a couple hours in, so I think I have a I have a timer going right now, and I'll try to keep this episode uh, about 40 minutes or so, 45 minutes. And then save the game just in case. Oh, that tree just went flying. <laughs> yes. And um, I'm going to need a new task for... Um, I'll do some weapon racks as well. First off, right up here. No, not there. There we go. Four weapon racks. Uh, new task for plant collection. Make that big and uh, centered on the crystal there to get all these plants. Priority up. Build job, priority up. Excellent. And um, a quarry as well. So I want to cut off this section of the map here. Okay, I gotta move it over. There we go. Make this as large as possible. Let's see. Where do I want the kill box to be? I think the kill box is going to be right in this area here. Um, so it would be better if I cut off this area here, huh? I played this map before in the past. Um, I didn't win the invasion mode on that one, but I'm planning on winning it this time. So I think like right here, and then I'll rotate the staircase. That seems pretty good. Yeah. Um, all the collection off right now. And accept that. Excellent. New test for a tunnel. Put that right against the wall right there. Priority off. Another tunnel in the same location. Uh, also priority off. So tunnel one. I'm going to just stretch that out this way and this way. Oh, it froze there for a second. I thought, I thought it was going to crash. <laughs> and then every other one I'm just going to pull out to collapse this area. Oh, okay, so that section wasn't needed. Okay, just all the collection off on that, and the priority of that isn't critical, so I'll leave it down for now. This one, I'm just going to move over one. And then up one. Uh, this was an accident here, so I'm just going to delete this section. There we go. And now, so this one's now offset. So I can collapse that for the resources, and so it's out of the way. There we go. That should be good for those two tunnels. So that section there will be completely out of the way. Um, I kind of want to do the same over here on this. That's okay, it's not critical at this point. I need to make uh, loom two of them. I'll do the looms back here. There and there. And the workshops as well. Workbenches.
There and there. Okay, and then a new job for a stone collection. I got lost there for a second. Boulders. <laughs> Excellent. Priority of that all the way up. If you enjoy this video, hit the thumbs up and let me know what you think in the comments. And subscribe for more videos. I have a um, pretty nice um, Japanese castle built uh, in Castle Story as part of a building challenge that we did uh, a little bit ago. I um, also have a victory of um, invasion mode victory of Zuma, which maybe you saw. And then um, I won conquest mode. Uh, lights out invasion uh, lights out conquest mode on uh, Calibri, which is a pretty good series as well Excellent. We got some stone blocks coming in and uh, now I can build my furnace Now I did the furnace. I wanted to do the furnace before I set any blocks so that way they did that first So I think the majority of um, Resource collection is going to be going on over here and we're going to be bringing the resources to build up this area so I want to maybe build the forge right here. Maybe I'll do two of them this time. Yeah, two for, two furnaces right there. So I'm going to need uh, four more stones, which is coming in. Great. This guy's stuck. <laughs> okay, we got Radis here. Um, Bagel. Emma. Benji. Cell, uh, celery. Okay, great. Excellent. Excellent. So we got celery, radis, uh, Benji, bagel, and Emma. And we got a bunch of plants here that are all set. And now these looms, that one's still under construction. This one I'll do rope on repeat. And I'm going to need more stockpiles as well already. <laughs> uh, so I'll do a line of stockpiles like here. Maybe there as well. And then one more offset by one. Right there. Excellent. Rope bridge right across here. I think I'll probably end up doing two rope bridges. But I'll just set one for now. And excellent, I got some stone coming in now. So once they build those furnaces, uh, then I'll start building up some walls over here. I want to cut off this section uh, so they all come up over here. I'm not really sure how I'm going to cut it off yet. I guess I could do a tunnel. Uh, let's see if I could zoom in here. Yeah, we'll do a tunnel. Make sure I'm not in the in this wall here. Right about there. Stretch this over here. And then uh, dig up this way. Resource collection off. And priority all the way up. Uh, I'll, I'll wait for the priority on that one. I want to get the um, at least one or two archery kits done. I got to spawn here. Who's this? Spag is here. <laughs> yes. Spag is here to work. And then this one here is going to be um, cloth on repeat. These two stock, this stockpile right here, except only um, cloth. This one right here, except only rope. You put that there. Excellent. Spag did it right. This way I'm gonna have, uh, okay. Radis gotta pick up this rope and move it over here. Excellent, excellent. Those are all complete as well. And now I can queue up some archery kits. Uh, two in each shop, uh, as well as a light in each. You know what, I'll, I, think the, uh, I think these workshops only cost wood, so maybe I'll just build a couple more workshops.
So right on the other side, maybe. Yeah, I'll do a third workbench there. Altars. Two altars right next to the crystal there. How much time do we have? Four minutes, 30 seconds. Excellent, I think we're doing pretty good. Um, we don't need any iron yet, but we're gonna need it pretty soon. Looks like they have way more wood chopped down than we need. Okay, so this tunnel then, I turn the priority all the way up. So they could dig that out and kind of cut that area off and then we'll reinforce it with some stone as well to kind of mess up the pathfinding for the corruptrons to come in this way. So, so hopefully they all go this way up over here. Um, when I do this one right here, I want the resources for this. Um, so I'm going to, instead of collecting the resources like this though, I'm going to do a new task for cleaning right there. And make that large enough so that way when all the resources fall, they fall into the cleaning area. And then the brick trunks will collect it. Oh, excellent. We got one complete archery kit. Done already. Uh, should be two now. Yeah, so we have uh, enough archery kits to get past the first wave, which is great. Excellent. Excellent. Yes, I just want to save the game um, relatively soon, just in case it crashes. Because, uh, yeah, I was playing last night on a different map, and the uh, game crashed out on me. Right, get back here. And the tunnel job there. Who is that? Spag. I thought you were, I thought you were one of the good ones. Excellent. Now they have to hop now, and but he's going to dig it down a little bit further. And what we'll do is uh, put some stone here. And this will hopefully deter the uh, corruptions from coming this way. Every time it freezes like that, I think the game's going to crash. <laughs> blocks there and there and then another set of blocks here this is going to take a lot of block resources away but should work out where should work out where the corruptions don't use this path uh, so it should be worth it half block there and there and then that's done and maybe I'll do another tunnel as well after we collect this iron resource. Now I have a closer one up here, but this one will be, if, if I can get the further one here, it'll be better. We got the bridge coming in as well. Excellent. And I have some more um, scattered resources over in this area. Um, Brimstone, iron, and then on the other side here, I have another brimstone and iron, as well as some boulders, and I think that's it. Okay. Now, they're not building the, um... I didn't turn the priority up there. <laughs> So with this, I'm gonna do uh, toggle print, blueprint management here. Select this right here. Um, split the blueprint. Here it is. And now this build job is uh, in blue and then the, fir the first blue job here is in blue and this is in white, so they're split out. So this one, the priority goes all the way up. Accept that, call to arms. This build job here, priority goes down. Uh, call the arms a couple more times, just in case. 
And now the um, first corruption wave is here. We're going to go out and find them with these uh, four archers here. Serral, Bagel, Radis, and Benji. Oh, here they are right now. Oh, you gotta come up here. Oh, great. Defend your crystals, Bricktrons. <laughs> Excellent. Back to work. And then a new cleanup task. Right here. Priority all the way up. Excellent, excellent. Uh, that should be fine. I can delete this tunnel. And then maybe I'll make a new tunnel. Maybe I'll make it uh, right about the same area there. Couple down. Like that. Resource collection often priority all the way up. So this way it's even deeper of a uh, pit there. Sometimes you gotta manually uh, have them pick up stones and then put them into the build job. But when you manually place them in the job right there, um, like that, sometimes they get stuck in the job once it's complete, so you just gotta be aware. Oh great, so this one's complete, so iron on repeat, but then we're gonna need um, a job to collect brimstone as well. Right here, we'll just do this close one for now. Priority up. Uh, we'll only do one priority down, so two. Uh, this iron right here, priority all the way up. That's the one down here. Oh, we got four of them in the tunnel here. I'll just get Radis out. And put Radis into um, this build job here. Put them in harvest. Oh yeah, so, so this build job is now complete and these two guys are stuck. So I just gotta go to that build job right here and delete. Just make sure it's the right one so that's all white, not blue. Okay, so I know I'm in the right one, delete. And now those guys just reset back to the crystal. See how much wood do I have? Enough, I think, for now. Oh great, he's getting the brimstone right there. Excellent. So when they're in this section here for the crystal, um, that's like the workshops. So this is uh, chopping block is considered a workshop. And then also if we were making more archery kits, which I'm queuing up now. And this one here, I'm gonna queue up just uh, two lanterns because I know it's gonna get dark pretty soon. Um, I'm gonna queue up some blocks over on this side too.
those four blocks right there. And then a lantern right on the side of that block. Maybe right there. I'm gonna put two sentinel wards. I'm gonna move the lantern over here. Uh, I got rid of this block here because I think that, um, like on this side, they could walk right here and place it. But on this side here, they can't place it like diagonally like that. So they would need to stand on a voxel that was right here in order to put that one there. So I'll have them place those before. But that's a little bit of way off. Um, the altars here need to be constructed first. till the next wave. Excellent. Excellent. So I built this pretty cool um, Japanese mountain castle. Um, and this is a series about it. It was for a um, community building challenge in the Castle Story Discord. And uh, came in third place, which is pretty cool. Oh, we got a new spawn here. Raviol. Raviol. <laughs> Raviol. Oh, great. He's in the uh, quarry job. I'm just going to turn up one. Just like that. I just want to dig down a little bit over here. Not too much, though. In that quarry. I think the majority of the wards are going to be in this section here. And so I want like a steel door right here. Let's start maybe planning that out right now. Not there. Oh great, okay. And I'll get rid of these tree stumps right here. this job over here and maybe shrink it down a little bit just for these two trees three trees there excellent so I'll have a wall with a door here um, cut off this ramp wall here with um, sentinel wards all on it and where archers can stand down here, this is getting cut off. I think it's complete. Yeah, it looks complete to me. Oh, over here. That's fine. Okay, delete that. Is he stuck? What happened? Is that wood blocking him? Okay. I guess that plank, those planks were blocking the stairs there, I guess. Um, drop load. And now get into mine in there. <laughs> Where are you going? Damn kid. Damn kid. Priorities all the way up. The quarry priority is not up. Okay, I got 37 seconds. Uh, we'll pull the arms. Let's see here. Okay, two more archery kits. And two more here. Is that everybody? Ah, oh, we got seven archers. Nice. gonna come over here right to this ledge here and then we'll um, collapse everybody on spang or spag and where are they 
they're coming from. Now I believe that they the one of the spawn points is like right here in this map. And then we have another spawn point somewhere over here. Oh, okay. Did I just see them? Yep, there they are. So these guys must have spawned in somewhere back here. This is a pretty good location for early... Um, for early engagement. back to work. And then these two tunnels here. Resource collection off, priority up, and this one as well. Priority up. That way I can move them uh, along this area. This area wouldn't be blocked anymore. Excellent. Everybody's back to work. Now these logs are becoming a problem here. <laughs> it's always too much logs as a problem. And I don't have enough stockpiles at all. Because I'm going to be collapsing this whole thing right here, so... More stockpiles. This one's tight, though. This, uh... I'll start building extra stockpiles back this way. Excellent. Boulders? Where's boulder collection? I think I already have that one right here, right? Yeah, boulders. So I think what I'll, um, yeah, I'll keep that one up. But I'll move it up here, yeah. I just need them to get some, uh, these altars complete. Build jobs have to be higher priority at all times. Build jobs have to be higher priority. That's what's going on. Too much resource collection, not enough building. Excellent. Excellent. I just saved the game and uh, cut ahead a little bit. I oh, just cut that part out, you know? <laughs> so this video is going to be coming out on um, Monday, the 26th of April, 2021. And then the next one, the next one is going to be coming out on Friday, the 30th. I'll record the next one on Friday, the 30th. Maybe I'll do Sat next Saturday. I'll leave it one week. Yeah. So this video will come out on the 26th. And then Saturday the 1st is when I'll record the next episode. Right? And I'll make sure to do that. Let's mark it my calendar here. So if you comment on this video between when it's out, but before Saturday the 1st, we'll say Friday at midnight. Yeah, let me maybe <laughs> let me collect all my thoughts here before I speak. So, twenty sixth of um, April, this video is going to come out. We'll say Friday at midnight, the thirtieth at midnight. The contest will end, and if you make a comment, it's a no purchase necessary contest. 
you comment castle story in this video um, if you don't own the game uh, I'll randomly select one of you who comment on the first on Saturday when I record the next one oh, it's starting to get dark now and that winner that person that I select will um, win steam keys to the game there's one one steam key for the game and for the OTS and this is the prize that I won for completing third place in the building challenge of the map uh, Yamajiro that I made and so it's a no purchase necessary contest it's gonna take place between Monday when this video comes out it starts and it's gonna go until the 30th of Friday midnight Eastern Standard Time <laughs> So you gotta comment before that. Comment Castle Story in the video's description and um, you'll be entered, no purchase necessary, and a chance to win the Steam key for the game and the soundtrack. I only have one Steam key set for each, for the game and the soundtrack. So one winner and it'll be great. <laughs> you get a free copy of the game. As a thank you for um, you know, watching the channel, checking out the channel, kind of as a give back to uh, any of my subscribers who don't have the game but enjoy my videos. You don't have to be subscribed to win, but I'm just gonna pick one at random. One person at random. Excellent, we got two of the uh, lanterns here and it's starting to get dark now, so maybe I'll build one of the lanterns. I want, um, uh, straight away we'll get light over in this area here. I queued up one lantern there, but they didn't build the job yet. And the official rules of the contest are going to be in the description of this video. Let's see. Just like this. Get rid of that one. We'll place those stones. Now I can place the lanterns right onto the ground. I don't normally like doing that. Um, but I can pick them up. So once you place the lantern on the ground, any ward on the ground, um, you can have the brick chunks walk over and pick it up. I believe that if you place it on the wall itself, then once it's on the wall, I think it stays on the wall until it's, um, until it's destroyed. I don't believe that you can collect it back once it's on the wall. But look at this, I got all this stone, all this wood, all this um, stuff nobody's building. Build drive priority all the way up. Okay, so this harvest priority will turn down. Tunnel priority will turn down. Same with this one. There we go, I got at least one guy in the build job now. Oh, where did he go? Spag, build job. You too, build job. Get rid of that one right there and do a reinforced iron door. Oh, you know what? Maybe I'll maybe I'll do up one level. Yeah, I'll stretch this across a little bit so they have to. They have to come up one level, and then I can hide a healing ward there. Have the door right here, so we'll offset these stones. Do a half block right there. Get rid of that one. Just voxel out this area here. So hold down control and press that to get the orange. When that when it's orange there, it's gonna be for removal. Except that. Okay, I got 14 seconds cold arms. Excellent. Okay, nothing too big. I got three, um, 
Three normal corruptions, two mini corruptions, mini trons. Excellent, everybody. Oh, they're they're right here already. Some stone flew off the side there. <laughs> okay, great. Yeah. So then, um, next Saturday, when I record the next episode, it'll announce the winner. I'm gonna spawn this guy. Who's this? Haribo. Haribo. Haribo is here to work. Excellent. So next Saturday, I'll announce the winner in the next video. Um, I'll record it on Saturday and then release it as soon as possible. Um, but the contest is going to end Friday night at midnight Eastern Standard Time. And on that Saturday, I'm going to try to record multiple episodes. Um, my new plan is to try to do one series at a time. For this one right here, I have a... I have a kind of a large recording block on Saturdays. So like um, I did one Dwarf Fortress episode and this episode. And then hopefully I'll be able to get some more in during the week. Um, this last week was pretty crazy for me. I worked like around 60 hours in my normal job. And then I probably put in, put in about um, a decent amount of time into the channel but more on the um, more on the like kind of social network side of it and thinking about and planning for the future of the channel you know you can only do so much on, in in one week <laughs> but now that hopefully most of that is out of the way i can um focus on video creation. So this one just needs 16. What build job is this? I got to get rid of this um, build job split right here. So the quarry here is taking up all these workers. So I got to turn the priority of that down one. Everybody there goes in there. this build job down here yep I need to get this uh, completed early so that way when the, like the warlocks and the biftrons come they come this way but nobody's building this uh, altars I'll have to split it again Once these altars are complete, then I can, I can, I want to reduce everything down to just one building queue if I can. Oh great, excellent. So I'll queue up a um, couple sentinel wards here, a healing ward. I don't think I need pylons right away. Oh, 
look great. They're coming in here. The stones are coming in. Now, nobody built these um, lanterns yet. Ah, uh, I need an empty handed one. There we go. Hopefully the AI will take over and place the lanterns. Oh great, it did. Emma's placing that one and then, great, we got some more light down now. Oh, and the same with these sentinel wards here. So I can place them down, but then pick them up as well. So I'm just gonna put them right here. The first four on those stones right there. Uh, oh good, he didn't get confused. Excellent. Uh, sometimes the AI for the uh, Bricktrons is like really terrible. <laughs> this game is 100% complete as far as I know. There's no news on any updates. It came out in like 2017. Uh, I have no idea what happened with the developers. Something happened with them. Um, where I got the Steam keys from was from the community, not from the developers. I believe that the developers sponsored the build challenge that I was in, and then the but it was a community build challenge, and then um, and then I got the keys from uh, Z Trashman and hold on a second and Kinder Bug. So Z Trashman and Kinderbug hosted the build challenge, the community build challenge, in the official Castle Story Discord. They got the keys from the developer, Sauropod Studios, and um, then I got uh, prize number three. <laughs> and that's where the um, Steam keys will be coming from. I don't think that the developer knows who I am still, uh, which is fine. I'm still kind of a small channel. Uh, that'll change eventually. I'm getting pretty decent growth on the channel, which is great. Um, a lot of positivity, which is excellent. And if you're not a member of the Castle Story Discord, um, you can do a, um, a search there in Google and you should find uh, forums. Um, if not, maybe you go over to the Reddit section. Um, r slash castle story and you'll find a thread for the castle story discord and that's where everybody sets up the multiplayer games um i think there there is some there's like a help section in the discord itself uh because this game does have bugs there are there are problems with the game and as far as i know they're not getting fixed but that's okay because it's still a great game <laughs> Oh great, I'm going to queue up some more of these Sentinel Wards here. I just want anything that comes into this area here to um, just be killed. I want this to be the kill box area and then we're going to defend... Maybe I'll build the... Maybe I'll change it here. And I'll just make a line right here. I do a line of blocks like that. I'm just uh, kind of theorizing right now. I'd have to turn it at a certain point because they're gonna, they may try to break through the wall right here to climb up behind the wall. So I could either do it straight across like this and do one turn, maybe like right here. And so I have this the corner of the the base, just like that, in case they climb up. I think that looks pretty good, yeah. So get rid of those stones there. And you need to get rid of some of these stumps. I just heard them spawn. 
Hold the arms. <laughs> I'm paying attention this time. I had several cups of coffee. Um, sometimes if I don't drink enough coffee, I, I kind of space out a little bit. Oh great, so we're going to just come up right here on top of this. Everybody right here. What are you doing? Radis. Oh, he's coming up on this side. Oh, they're all over the place. Oh, nice, nice. Excellent. Back to work. Excellent. So I just want to give a special thank you to Kinderbug and Z Trashman for uh, sponsoring the building challenge um, and giving me those Steam keys that I will then pass on to uh, one of the lucky viewers of this video. And that's all the time I have. Thank you very much for watching. I'm just going to save the game.